don't worry, Dijon. You're not being docked. I, I did not record your your stuff there. I did not record your trophies that you got in uh, My Name is Mayo. Need to update my capture, gaming capture rate. I don't think it's the, the computer. I think it's user error. <laughs> anyway. Um, so yeah. Oh yeah, Okami HD. I, I need to finish streaming that. I really do. Anyway, uh, yeah, I was playing Night in Woods earlier. Anyway, um, welcome to Final Fantasy, uh, no, World of Final Fantasy. Um, it's like Pokemon, but good. I'm throwing shade of Pokemon there. Teeth, yes. Yeah, I, I I agree that Pokemon is good. Um, this stagnated a lot, honestly. I can't play any generation of Pokemon more than once these days. Because so I'll play through it, and then I'll be like, why the fuck am I playing through this again? It's exactly the same. Um, have things been, for me, they've been pretty good. World of Final World Fantasy. World of Final Fantasy. We're gonna do a new game. We unlock a bunch of stuff for downloadable content. A bunch of Coliseum tickets, which I don't even remember what this what they're for. I think they're for like fighting stuff. Uh theater mode. Your life has been pretty final fantastic. Oh Prologue. Awake at last. Um, at any point, let me know if the game audio is too out. Um, because I don't have any stuff going on for bouncing for that right now. Um. Oh no, it's Kesha. Look, Kesha's, Kesha's good. I enjoy Kesha. Especially now that she's allowed to do, like, the shit that she wants to do. And not what a horrible sex abuser was telling her to do. <sighs> We're getting some pre to precariously close to upskirt territory on this literal child. So you'll continue to mock, uh, God, um, Lady Gaga. Lady Gaga is, like, the weird one that I really enjoy. Hey, guys, might not want to stand too close to the edge. No railings. Time to wake up. Apparently Osha doesn't exist. Yeah, see, that exact thing could happen. Huh? <sighs> <sighs> what a nap. 
We've got a cute thing on our head. Oh, right. I gotta get to work. Think you might be lost? Press the touchpad to- oh. oh. Am I gonna make it? The boss hates when I'm late. Then again, it's not like business has picked up any. I'm extremely lost at what the fuck is going on. Yeah! That's, that's about right for a Final uh, Fantasy game. <laughs> the streets sure are quiet today. Well, look, I mean, like, it's, it's not all bad. We got a cat on our head. We're more like a fennec fox, I would think. Nine bean coffee! Oh, hell yeah, nine whole beans! Hey, I'm here. How'd she get in if no one's here yet? Good morning. I'm real sorry. I hope you haven't been waiting long. Huh? Mm. Oh, right. She needs some water. Oh, no thanks. A pint. I mean, a cup of coffee, please. Oh, and bring the whole jar of sugar. I'm gonna need it. Right. That's one cup of joe. And I'll get you one of the big jars. Is nobody Listen, it's not the coffee? number of beans, it's how you use them. Get it together, guys. Also, I would think that eight bean coffee is even more watered down I'm than sorry, nine miss. bean coffee. You're this gonna need more than nine while. beans to hey, make no one hurry. cup of coffee. Time's Just saying. But eight bean coffee, that'd be even worse. Here you go. Thank you. Sure. All right, let's count them. All right. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, thirteen, thirteen lumps of sugar. Oh, there's a reason that she's not questioning the uh, the, the creature on his head. Your age, huh? Hey, don't talk down to me. Listen, last time I checked, little bro, I've been around. I like Lon's increasingly worried uh, face as she just okay, keeps putting okay. lump after I lump of sugar into there. Very sorry. <laughs> so, what's up? I'm all ears. Well, you don't have to get all sarcastic. Uh, you really are all ears. Uh, what? Forget it. So, Lon, have you seen anybody this morning? Well, yeah, I mean, I'm looking right at you, aren't I? And there's that customer. What? Ah! Oh, hello! You didn't even see her? Dude. Uh, yeah, but... Ah! Uh, look! Come with me right now! Easy! I'm really digging the off-brand uh, Starbucks logo there. There's nobody here! So, it's a quiet morning. Maybe they just... I mean no one! Huh? Lon, have you bumped into anyone today besides her? Uh, now that you mention it, I guess not. And this isn't setting off any alarms? Well, should it? You two really don't remember a thing. Huh? What was that? Who are you? 
if you're from around town. So is the game too loud compared to, to my you. audio? Uh, rain matters. Because I could turn it down a little you bit if it is. You two really don't remember a thing. Would you please just answer my question? You can call me Anna Crow. Anna Crow will work. Okay, well, we woke up to a ghost town this morning. Maybe you know why? Yes, you're quite alone. But you always have been. Huh? This world, it's always been the two of you. A world without time. One that ended when it began. What? That's the weirdest thing I've heard. But don't worry. Just because the world ended doesn't mean that it's going Lady, anywhere. Lady, you are not making any sense. You know, I have been checking up on you two. Until now, you were nothing but blank stares. So imagine my surprise when Lon took my order. What a morning. Okay. Now you're kind of scaring me. So, now that you're awake, we've got a story to tell. Which brings us to... Tama! Right to here! Uh, who the hog put this thing on my head? Yeah, I did try to mention it before. You take Fun. it from here. Did you really... I'll go on ahead and link up a path. You're the goddess! Did you really not? Huh? Hey, <laughs> hey you hey. can't just leave! I forgot that Lon literally did not know that Tama was on there. The name is Tama, and I'm here to help out. Does anyone have any questions? Huh. Wait, I've got tons of questions. Why were you sitting on my head? And how the hell can a fox even talk? That's the seriously the first thing on your mind? <sighs> now I see why in a crow is just about the ready to throw in the towel. We're not allowed to be confused? Uh, hey, whoa, uh, take it easy there, Lon. I thought you were upset Let's too. Let's start the over. I'll make us some of the coffee. Huh? Oh, yes, please. But I already made some coffee before you got here. How can you just roll with this rain? Chill the owl. You'll live the much longer. Yeah, Lon. You shouldn't start out your morning with so much stress. <laughs> oh, would you the like some sugar? I mean, the, the Three keeps whole for you, right, putting Lon? random huh? thuds in, one. No. in her okay, I'll pattern go and put the is a lot on. less annoying than I just um, said I... than some of uh, Captain N's no, questionable just give me my dang cup choices. Mega high! Mega high! Mega high! Garage keepers? Me and Rain? That's the correct! Those the marks on your arms are proof. You were born to work the miracles. Miracles? Our arms can do that? Dude. How could you the forget? You used to command a whole the legion of them. You were masters of them. Powerful living illusions known as mirages. In the fact, even the Pleiad answered to you and those are the seven strongest mirages of all. With their power, you could have the ruled over all the world! Oh. So, we could have ruled the world? Because, what, we controlled these mirages? Mirages well, that's what I've heard. Oh, come on, who? What do you mean? In a crow that told me, of course. But enough the reminiscing. I've got to teach you two to use <laughs> mirages again. <laughs> How's that? First off, I'm going to present you with my very own Prismarium. So what does it do? With this Prismarium, That's the Mirage inside you is a, yours. a ball of you ice in a square of ice. That's, what? So let's the try it right now in glorious combat. Wait, what? It's the combat tutorial! Oh boy! You forget how combat works in this game, so I am I am glad. <laughs> Just gave the fuck up pop and rest it! <laughs> okay, go ahead and throw some attacks out there! To take action, you need to spend something called action points, also known as AP. You automatically gain a little bit of AP each the time your turn comes around in battle. The amount of AP you need depends on the what you're trying to do, so make sure you use them wisely. 
Okay, so, um, the... That's right, um, it's coming back to me. So, the active time battle gauge works differently in this game. Uh, you do get a chance to, like, choose what you want to do, because things just move up on the bar. And, uh, depending on your actions, you can actually, um, interrupt people's turns and send them further down on the bar, which is neat. See, so, like, since, uh, what's its name, what's her name's, uh, turn came up, I can just shoot to attack or defend. Of course, there's going to be more options, since she goes back down to the bottom, and, uh, Lon here can also attack and defend. And apparently miss. Yeah, that's the way, that's to, the way to do it, the sheep until you missed. And each turn, you gain, um, gain ability points. This thing gets to go. Oh, you can also switch between um, this form and the classic, like, hey, look at this. Semi-active. To some of you, this classic menu style may look very familiar. Ah! <laughs> you just picked this thing up and put it directly in the chat. Yeah! I mean, it's not like... Won't be able to do much in there. So combat usually does not go by this slow. Um. All right, all right. I think I've seen enough for one to tussle. We did it. So yeah, combat usually goes by a lot faster than that. It's just trying to get used to the whole thing. Oh, we also got seven bucks out of that. The two of you were unsurpassed. No, the Mirage could stand up to you. Dude, seriously? Dude, but seriously. It's hard to believe. I'm sure it is. As far as I can tell, you two have lost everything. All the memories and experience you've ever accumulated. Oh, but wait. Of course that would have happened when you and this world were spliced out. Huh? So not only did they lose the Mirages they had, They've been the stripped of all their memories of the Mirages, too? But, I guess that explains why all their other memories seem to be largely unaffected. What? Listen, let me show you something. Listen, no, the Tail Crown is great and glorious, Dijon. I will not have you slandering the, the Tail Crown. Literally my favorite, favorite part of that thing's design is that its tail has a crown there, because its head is too light. small lies another world called Grimoire. That is where you'll find all the mirages you've lost. You mean they're all inside this gate? You got it. Are you ready to conquer them again? So, um, if we do manage to find all the lost mirages, does that mean we'll be able to remember the things we forgot? Well, I don't know about that. The once in future After button. After all, you lost your memories. It's not the same thing as forgetting them. Oh. But... Even if you don't remember Grimoire, Grimoire still knows a lot about you. You're certain to find traces and records of your past. Okay, so like... You're saying whether we remember anything about ourselves or not, we can still find clues about our past and the things we've done? Correct. And if you keep on gathering mirages, I think you might even meet your family in due time. Uh, our family? Huh? Well, I guess... It does make sense that we'd have parents. Oh, yes. So then, you going? You going? Will you journey to Grimoire? <sighs> no, we're not. Uh, that's, that's the end of the game right there.
We decide not to go. We decide, no, it's done. We're done. Save data is being uploaded to the server. Don't turn the game off. Ah! Chapter 1 Land of the Lilikin. So, this must be Grimoire. What? <laughs> now they really are Funko Pops. What? You look like such a little dweeb. <laughs> oh, uh, uh, <laughs> I know. We look ridiculous. <laughs> huh? Oh, don't the worry. I'm sure that's how every the body in this world must look. And a crow just wanted to make sure you had a nice and a handy way of blending in. Wow, she can do stuff like that? That is awesomely weird. Well, this kind of works out. We won't have anybody gawking at our arms. Way to find the silver lining. Color people called giants with a J because that's how you spell giant. I guess we should head straight down this path? It's the only direction we can go. Think you can manage to not get lost? You know, just this once. What? I'm not gonna get lost. Yet. Oh, look, it's Chocobo! Little baby Chocobo! Oh, hello. I spy another mirage. That is the call to Choco Chip. What are you the waiting for? Go on and imprison the it. Okay. All right. Let's capture the little baby choke bow. It's like a Pidgey. Or a Rattata. It's our first Pokemon. <laughs> Let's jail this baby. I mean, you're basically doing the same thing to Togepi. So, little child. So what now? First, you're the going to need this. It looks sort of like a prismarium. What is it? That's the call to prism. Use it to the make the Choco Chicks prismarium. Every time you find a new the mirage you haven't seen before, it'll be recorded in Anna Crow's special mirage manual. Whoa! Does it even have pictures? You the betcha. And then whenever you add a new mirage to the manual, you receive one of its prisms. But only the first time the mind you. Okay, first, try the weakening the Choco Chip, then the use your yeah. prism. So, unlike Pokemon, there's a bunch of different ways that you can capture monsters. Um, um, so, like, some monsters can only be caught if they're, like, poisoned or if they're asleep. Uh, but some monsters just work like po exactly like Pokemon. So, um, this one, we just have to weaken it a bit. I didn't mean to defend. Oh well. There! A prism tunity! Use the imprism command to the claim that mirage for your own! Go on! The select the imprism command! You might have to try different things before certain mirages will let down their guard and give you a chance to imprison them. Think the outside of the box. Yes. Beaver can often provide you with a good hint. Ow! This little baby hit me! In prison! <laughs> this 
just walk up and sit on Hey, then look! Listen, who did it? Depends if it now allows it, if this place allows it to the rest or not. It's yours to the keep! Oh, yeah! Oh, look how much level experience rate needs to level up! Nice! These feathery friends love to headbutt things! This is fine because an egg chocobo's eggshell never cracks twice! Okay, what should we name this guy? What do we name him? We can name can be up to ten characters long. What are we gonna do? What are we gonna name him? I'm a big fan of Boko because I'm a, because Final Fantasy V, but like eh, everybody names him Boko. Haku? Hmm, Haku could work. Ooh, Big Bird. I'm torn between Cuckoo and Big Bird. I don't know. I like Big Bird better than Yoshi. That's even Big Bird, because he's big and yellow. Looks good. It's at the uh, mm. Cool! I can see the Choco Chick running around in the prismarium. Pretty the neat, huh? Next, why the don't you have a go at stacking that Choco fit. Chick on your head? Here, watch, I'll just show you. Yeah. Oh, now I get it. So when I saw you perched on Lon's head back in Ninewood Hills, that's what you call stacking. Yep, that's the right. While I'm up to here, I get to take it nice and the easy. Uh, is that stacking or slacking? When you create a stack, the HP of everyone in the stack uh. gets the added together. Like they say, strength in the numbers. Oh, so it's like combining into a super robot. Better than yet, your magic and other abilities have the potential to change too. It all depends on how your stack is the configured. Huh? Oh, I don't need any action figures when I get to blast out super attacks like a super robot. Well, just be the careful. Stacking doesn't then make you invincible. Some of the enemy attacks have the power to unstack you. In other words, bye-bye super robot, so to speak. Yowzers. It does sound like bad news. It's true that we are individually the weaker when we're unstacked. But look on the bright side. Since we each get our own the turn in battle, we can use the extra moves to have one member attack and another the heal. It can be very the helpful. Depending on the situation, you might even decide to unstack yourselves by choice. Think the carefully, and choose the best setup for the job. Yeah, so, um... That, that's a, that's a mechanic in this game, is that you can stack, uh, stack things. So, um, there's three categories, small, medium, and large. You can have one, uh... So your character will either count as a medium or a large, depending on what form they're in. So if you're in like your, if you're in your normal si size form, you count as a large. If you're in your chippy size form, you count as a medium. Um, By the way, you two can just switch between giant size and lilikin size. Depending on your size, you can make different stacks. You aren't the allowed to put big things on top of the small things when creating a stack. So, to get on top of a mirage, you need to the be in Lilikin form. The best way to the learn is to try it once you've rounded up a few more mirages. You'll pick it the up in no time. Yeah. Uh, so... Let's give her... Our... Let's give her a big bird. So she'll have Big Bird on top of her head. Oh, hello. What's that? Huh? A dead end? But there's nowhere else to go. What are we gonna do? Never the fear! Look the closely, 
Golly! This may appear to the be a wall, but it's actually a guinea golem. Is this a mirage too? Not in the traditional the sense of the word. But you'll see these pests all over Grimoire. And unless you they give them what they want, they'll give you a hard the time and block the way. So what is it they want? It really the depends on the guinea golem. So the first thing you'll have to the do is examine it. Gimme, gimme! I was... I was not expecting that voice out of that thing. But, uh, so where do we find Monster that? Leaf. That choco chick you just imprisoned ought to be able to track the down what we need. But first things the first, you're going to have to unlock the right ability on the choco chick's the mirage board. So the mirage board is basically their their ability up stuff. Um, so. go to Big Bird's uh, Mirage Mirage board and see those big these big cubes um they are that that's their evolve forms so they don't evolve when they level up uh, you can you actually unlock uh, the new the new forms uh, by by going through their stuff and al also there's a little level, bit of level requirement oh I'm dropping frames oh no yeah I don't know. Mm. Hold on a second. So, um, so you might not have heard me explain this, uh, but, put, uh, mirages don't evolve simply by level requirements uh you have to go through their tree and also meet a level requirement but the nice thing about it is that um is that mirages can go back and forth between forms at any time so uh even even if this thing evolves we can always devolve it later Until Choco Chick's like, hey, I found something. Beep, beep, I'm a Jeep. Huh? It found something. Yeah, we found a luster leaf, so now we can Yay, give it to the gimme golem. The found it. Now, try examining the gimme golem one more at a time. Gimme, gimme! Congratulations, we fucking Whoa, killed it. It vanished! That's so cool. I guess the choco chick found us just the item we needed. Mirage are the two, there's nothing that you can't accomplish. And Mirage boards are for much the more than unlocking abilities. You can also use them to change your Mirages into new and the powerful forms. So be sure to keep on the leveling up and working on your Mirage boards. Pretty soon you'll be bouncing and the trouncing across Grimmore like a pair of the pros. But yeah, uh, Choco Chick needs to be level 10 and also learn a couple of, uh, of moves before it can evolve. And even then, uh, you can swap between 
forms at will, so there's there's some stuff that uh, it will know that its adult forms will not know. So, Tama, I notice mirages disappear when we defeat them. Why is that? Most of the mirages you see in Grimoire don't actually the technically belong in this world. Huh. Wait. Now, that's weird. Who was it that told me all this before? Ugh. It's like, right there, on the tip of my tongue. It had a swap. I guess I can't yet. Now what's this? This is the Kata Mercury. Inside you're the likely to find mirages that are, shall we say- Mirages? Say... Oh man, let's go catch them! But... Well. Oh. Oh. Uh, this one's not very cute. What are you talking about? Behemoths are adorable. Vaughn! Why did you... Now what do we do? I tried to tell you. Inside Mercris, you're likely to find mirages that are the strong and dangerous. You tried to tell us. Try a little harder, please. I mean, this is the cutest behemoth I've ever seen. Oh. Uh. Guys, I think we may be fucked. Oh no! Oh no! Lon, what did you do? Oh no! Oh no! Did you two die already? Did you two die what? already? I died. <laughs> what? No way! Maybe it's true that Mirage and the Murkriff did kinda. Well, I'm still alive. Yes, that's because someone intervened right at the moment of your demise and made it so the battle never happened. Wow, you can really do that? Of course, although Tom is the one who does it. That's the right. I have the power to rewind time a little, and then the wisdom Mario to has time, the Although, power to rewind it time, me a life to do it, but so only I hope you the don't mind wants. if I rest for a little the while afterwards. A life? You might not believe it, but I've actually got multiple lives. Back there, I had to sacrifice one of those lives to turn back time and to save you. You see, this girl with the ribbon that showed up in my dreams, she's the one who taught me how to the do it. That makes zero sense and kind of freaks me out, but Tama, I'm impressed. But thanks! Oh, but just so you know, I can only the use my powers to protect the two of you specifically. And only the if you lose a fight, like what happened to you in the Murkrift. Oh, the yeah! And I can always the recover my lives if you stay here and let me the rest a spell. So, don't forget to give me a breather before I run out of second the chances. Dude, you got it. Say no more. Rest yourself, silly. Yes, this, sir. Thanks, Tama. We really owe you one. Especially Lon, who didn't have the good sense to listen before diving in. D uh, <laughs> so yeah, you can game over, hey, but uh, who's that? Tama does have some. Oh, if you mean our new guest, powers. she claims to have gotten herself lost. Go say hello. She's quite the character. Uh, okay. The real Where'd question is how she got she here from the outside world when it's there. no easy trick. Oh, she must have experience crossing between Would planes. Oh, look, it's a safe cube. <laughs> Probably safe. Even complete. 
Oh no, it's uploading a game to the server! To avoid corrupting my save data, do not push the PS... So, she's over at North Promenade. Wow, she's so tiny. Is she a, uh, what's the word again? Lilligan? Excuse me, that's their word for it, Rain. Chocobo Colina! Oh. <coughs> Hello, and how are you? Hmm? Uh, good, more or less. You know, what a nice quiet place. Sure you don't want to oh, like, dress uh... up more? So who are the you? Oh, you can call me Chocolate. You can't see it. I seem to have washed up here like a soggy yellow feather hand. in a storm. That's my head. Huh? I do like, have this funny oh, knack boy. for winding up in strange places. Uh, cool. All right. Care to shop? I've got the goods. Chocoboco Chase. Gotta use the money. But yeah, we can buy a bunch of stuff. Um, sometimes it's just oblivion. Right? We can also sell some stuff, but like, there's nothing. There's no reason to buy it. Whoa! Slow down. What kind of operation is this? It's called a shop, dear. You're in luck! I find all kinds of stuff as I bounce from point A to point Q. I'm your Choco Connection! The question is, how do I transform? Oh, okay. All right, well. So, hey, are you ready to head back to Grimoire? Selfish selfer poo. Well, I don't remember you the raising me at all. Who's this? Oh, hi. I'm just your adorable local wind pixie, aka Seraphie. My hobbies include gossip mongering and, uh, let's see. Oh, I'm good at hoarding things. Yep. Hoarding? Hoarding. Why do you think I'm here? You must have tons of prismariums, more than you can handle, right? Well, we're still working on it. Uh-huh. You'll have scads of them before long. You're gonna need a place to unload. Yeah, they are kind of bulky. Well, who's got you covered? This pixie right here. Anacro made me a special prism case that lets me keep all your prismariums safe. Just plonk the ones you don't need in and yoink the ones you do need out. All plonking and yoinking must be performed within the confines of Nine Wood Hills or from an alternate location with a suitably strong connection. Additional terms, conditions, and restrictions may apply. Okay. I'm not sure I caught every single word, but I guess Fuck I agree. You, Brain, oh, yeah. for making this joke that I was to one going to make. Tribe. Treat it with the same boundless love and affection you feel for me. Okay. Seraphie's kind of a special the case. Dang it. 
obtained a seraphone. <laughs> what? Okay. <laughs> Data's important. Okay. Okay, I just earned this thing, I guess. Um, what should we name it? I don't remember getting this. I wonder if this is DLC. I bought, like, all the DLC to this game, and I, I don't quite know what it does for me. Maybe you do get this in the base game. I don't remember. It's been so long. So, uh, no, let me change it. Okay, Pixie Cat then. Looks good. Yeah, yeah. Mastodon, what? Mastodon, what? Swap between forms. I don't remember how to do it. I don't remember how to do it. Hold on, I'm gonna look this up. I, I see you right there. It's your fault. Okay, so here's how you do it. I, f I figured it out. So you hold L1 and you push square and circle. Uh, square changes uh, lawn and circle changes rain. should be able to manage on your own from here. You mean you're the leaving us? Yes. You handle things now. Oh, okay. I the will. It's cool. Mm. I'll lock this place mm. down tighter than a Marlboro's bottle of mouthwash. That's a Seraphie guarantee. Huh? Oh, but she but where are you going now? Oh, well. Somewhere uh, else, of course. Mean? Yeah, that's huh? not exactly very helpful. Awesome. <laughs> Look, we really need to ask you so many things. I do like no, that the no, other companions, like the, the I can't do everything are, for you now. aren't just standing everything still and now. waiting for the conversation to happen. Really doing stuff. Besides, every world has its own rules. <laughs> She's still like the water gas and fire, <laughs> and light vanishing darkness. Uh, I think that's just called science. Well, I designed mine to be so completely unbreakable that even I can't undo them. Undo what? The rules. <sighs> You're bad at explaining. You're saying you can't help because that violates the rules of the world or something? Exactly. But why is that? I mean, come on. Just who do you think you are? 
Me? Oh, well... I'm God. <laughs> ah, shit, she's the final boss, guys. She's gone. Dude. Uh, I guess we can't necessarily rule it out, but for somebody calling the cosmic shots, she seems kind of sub-benevolent. Well, that's Anna Krell for you, so get used to it. So, she really is God? Beats me. Anna Crow is Anna Crow, wouldn't you say? Pity the much. Uh, thanks for clearing it up. Yeah, we met God. So yeah, we can also fast forward through cutscenes, which is good. Having a way to skip cutscenes, especially 15 minute long cutscenes before an extremely powerful and hard boss is always appreciated. Fuck you, Final Fantasy X on PlayStation 2, you piece of shit. For... Anyway, let's uh let's not fucking get immediately annihilated. Well, that certainly cost us a chunk of time. And whose fault is that? Oh, uh, yeah, I want names. <laughs> anyway, um, we also have, we have to, uh... We have to set up our stash for the big forms, so... Let's give her our show, the big bird. Can't stack. We don't have the ability to, um. Give her Pixie Cat as well. I think Pixie Cat has the ability to heal? I don't know. Let's stick with what we've got for now. I mean, we haven't really been playing around with them for long, so. Oh, now b battles happen randomly. Oh, look at the squirrel! Hold down R1. Oh! I'm using the basic menu. However, you can override this to manually select the target. Okay. Um, let's go to the classic. Oh, hey! And luckily, uh, things that aren't in our party do gain a little bit of experience, so Pixie Cat does a gain some experience. Alright, so what should we name our little squirrel friend? A cute little forest animal, or at least that's what it wants you to think, then POW! A tail punch to the jaw! Tail punch? What? This mirage has nothing to do with the legendary continent. May or may not squeak, moo, when upset. Squorb. Ooh, Squorb is good. Oh, is that how um, Pokemon Let's Go works? I haven't gotten a chance to play that yet, because I don't, because I'm asking for it for Christmas. Yeah, Squorb. We're agreeing then. Oh, everybody agrees, Squorb is good. A little squirrel orb. Okay, so eight percent of the um, of the experience goes there, which is a weird number. Honestly, it's a really weird number. Eight percent. 
but okay. No trouble at all. Oh, right! Big Bird blow it up. Hooray! Um... Let's see. So, what are we gonna do? I don't remember. Alright, let's avoid fighting the behemoth for now. Lon, don't touch it this time. I know, I know. But could we see all this stuff before? Now that you've fought that thing the once, you can see all its information. And if you happen to know some Libra magic, you can peep at its data before you even jump in. Very good thing to keep in the mind. Got it. Yep. Very good thing to keep in the mind, Lon. Uh, why are you repeating it? And just for my sake? Hmm. Hmm. I wonder why we're repeating it for your sake, Lon. I wonder why. Oh, that's right. I was gonna go into the menu and um, make it so that the class is default. All right, victory! Battle menu, classic, there we go. I wasn't trying to say anything while this was happening, but man, I cannot wait until I get some fucking Magitek armor. Holy shit! Look at that! Is that... Is that Nemesis? That is... That is straight up Nemesis from Final Fantasy X. Oh, speaking of Final Fantasy X, I saw Titus too.
Hi, Ancient. How are you? I called Nemesis in this game. That was, well, to be fair, there's a bunch of different, um, there's a bunch of different, there's like three monsters in the Chapter game two. that use the same Foretold uh, thing, so by it might prophecy. either be Ultima weapon or uh, Omega weapon, but I like going with Nemesis because simply because it was the super boss. I hope we're almost out of the woods. Do you see any large collection of trees, Flan? Hey, sis, is that a town over there at the end of the bridge? Yeah, and I don't know why, but something about it takes me back. Huh? 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 Hmm. Uh, yeah, Nemesis was a recolor of Ultima Weapon. Make a weapon. Hmm. So, uh, oh, here comes one of my favorite parts of this on? game. Absolutely. I'll be aboard. Oh, dude. A uh, cactar train? Yeah, it is. Hmm. It's the cactar express. <laughs> Hey, sis, let's park it here. Sure. <laughs> oh. um, uh... uh, hi. <laughs> so, so tiny. Whoa, look, my needles. I don't know how long it's been since we've had new passengers. Look, my needle. Huh? Huh? <laughs> there he is. Right, tickets, please. <laughs> I love this. It's so good. <laughs> oh, a mirage? What? It talks? Oh, I indeedly needly am a mirage. <laughs> but I'm also the train conductor, so... Tickets, please. Yeah, I played... Uh, I think I finished chapter two. All right. Uh, the chapter Tom where I have not gotten not? past like, the final but phase one bit of this game. That we need. Right so it, and it's been so hell? long since I played it that I have wow. labeled it blind. Semi lifetime anyway. passes, eh? Haven't feasted my eyes on one of these in a swell spell. Right then, pleasant journey. <laughs> Here he goes. <laughs> this dude brings some information. I made sure provided with everything you could ever need. This is the best train. Okay then. It is so good. So why a semi lifetime pass, and not a lifetime one? I bought all the DLC to this game. I am playing on PlayStation 4, but I have gotten all the DLC that comes with this game. Also, welcome to Cornelia. I like swords. 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 Wow, this place rules. Yeah, it's like something right out of a fantasy. Hey, Tama. Why don't you hit your ride? Roger the Dodger! Pardon. Huh? If I may ask, would you be kind enough to tell me what country you hail from? Oh, us? We're, uh... Ah! <gasps> Mirage is from the Hamushin Army! Oh, no, it's goblins! Bahamu? What's... a Bahamu? Well... The Bahamutian Federation has a whole army of mirages in their control. Huh? Someone's made a whole army out of them? Sounds just fine by me. Line them up nice and neat for us, so we can round Let's them up. Let's go beat those gerblins. Hey, wait up! Uh, one. Let's 
Gerblin. All right, you Bahamoos. What's your beef, huh? You even make it sound like they're made of beef. <sighs> yeah, Lon. Don't you know it's at stake? Oh no, it resists fire. That was a mistake. Uh, let's ram it then. Wow. I'll attack the weaker one. There we go. Gotcha. Go. just happened? Why wasn't I able to imprison that mirage? Didn't you see the light the surrounding it? That means it's the beholden to another keeper. The what? B.O.? The smell? Uh, no! Alright, Zero Hagane, uh, the if I had, do have any questions, I master. will ask you. So I've, I've you played a little bit of this game before, but I haven't to be able to claim it, for it. Like, I never got very far in it, so I'm, I'm trying to, uh, to stay blind. Fire whoever wrote that little hook in. Lon, it's nay on the fourth wall stuff. Giants. Oh, whoops. Are they Bahamutian soldiers? But they drove the mirages off for us. It's just like the prophecy, word for word. But which one? Well, we know how it ends. Please, may I speak with you? Huh? Oh, uh, sure. Just so that the new people who are coming in the two uh, know, You've traveled the, the whole gimmick of this world. dream is you guys are oh, naming my well, mirages for me. I wouldn't. I mean, like, I'm not coming up with any of the actually, names myself. I I, I'm picking the best on. ones that I like. But, like we're mirage if, too. When I, when I catch a mirage, Don't tell her. I'm asking for names. Why not? And then I will Face it, it's awesome to try and hide it. I'm like exuding all over. Mon, you don't even know what exude means. There is someone who would like to have a word with you. Could you possibly stop by Castle Cornelia? So let's find this Casa Cornelia's place. Doesn't Casa mean up? It's gotta be higher up. Well, you've got the direction correct. Even if the rest of that was completely off the base. That woman must be important if she's inviting us to the castle. Right, tickets, please. Oh, we just got here. I was hoping he'd say something funny. Oh. What's up, guys? Nice armor. Leave them alone, please. He needs to punch your brother into non-stupidity. <laughs> Come on. Listen, he's not Thank dumber than Titus. Welcome Let's to say the that much. Cornelia. I am Princess Sarah. Wait, you're like a princess? We had no idea. Oh my gosh. I am so sorry Lon acted like such a royal idiot. I'm not royal. Oh, and I'm his older sister, Rain. It's an honor. Please forgive the ruse. Oh, At no, first I suspected that you might be agents sent here by Bahamut. I was wrong. You stood up bravely against their mirages and kept our town safe. All of Cornelia thanks you. Oh, I wouldn't say we were that brave. Really. <sighs> Stop, you're so modest. 
Still, the fact of the matter is, we didn't do anything all that outstanding. Yeah, we're more the in-standing types. Huh? I'm pretty sure that in-standing isn't an actual the word. <laughs> oh, forgive me. It's just so hard to believe that you two are the stuff of Or not. I don't even need to... I don't even need to restart it. The screen oh, fixed itself. that's Good. right. I think I heard the townsfolk going on about some kind of prophecy, too. Oh, I am I sorry. Be Titus times. Only at times, if like, I think me, overall... I Titus will explain it from the beginning. Town. You see, Cornelia is an unfederated state midway up Grimoire. Unfederated? Yes. Let me explain that as well. The majority of Grimoire's countries and municipalities there's, there's have many annexed themselves that to the Bahamutian should have caught on a lot sooner than he did. The Herald King. Like, he made it super obvious that the pilgrimage is a fucking Cornelia, suicide however, run. Has continued to maintain like, its, its sovereignty. It's all but spelled out for him at several points in the game, and he's still surprised when it is finally just outright stated. He's like, "What? No, nobody and now told Bahamut me this." Has what? Taken to armed provocation. You mean like that mirage like, attack before? Dude, we all but yes. so we all but told you multiple times in the games. He's so the Azure he's extremely thick, but I guess that's what happens when time when begins. You are a sportsman who regularly gets concussions because you play. Uh, sports that require you to hold your breath own. underwater Grimoire, with no safety they will equipment reach on. Two divergent futures. One that brings salvation. That too. Other ruin. That too. Uh, he's told not to talk about anarchy. It's anarchy. And then he's like, I have to stop playing anarchy. Rika. Immediately. Oh man, Tama, this prophecy is about you. What? What are you even talking about? There's nothing. The way I smell. You big the dummy! Well, at least I'm dumber than you! I'm sorry, Your Highness. I'm afraid there's just no hope for them. Oh. Anyway, I missed a complete. So, the giants from the hills, as in Ninewood Hills? I guess it's kind of those something believe here. what you I want to things, but yeah, so like, far, hey, these two guys it does seem to match up. up. Um, do you mind if I ask you a slightly <laughs> awkward question? If this federation is really so terrible, why have so many countries agreed to become members? Most of the mirages in Grimoire, not all, but certainly most of them, are now firmly under the federation's control. With such a powerful army behind them, citizens can go about their lives. Without fearing the mirages, it still roam free. I'm, I'm going to stream Dude, Final Fantasy X one day. Many mirages? Uh, him, but, Seriously? Uh, let's, let's just say that y yes. there are s several uh, points where dude. it should become Whoa. exceedingly obvious that it's a suicide and run, and yet it is command all of still a giant surprise when everybody tells him that it's a suicide run. So there was a queen of the keepers. Sounds like she was pretty powerful. Yes. But that was more than a century ago. So, sorry for the string of dumb questions, but if the Federation can guarantee that kind of absolute protection, wouldn't it be worthwhile to take them up on their offer? It may seem wise, but you see, membership in the Federation involves following their laws and adoption of a heinous creed. It chills me right to the marrow of my bones. That bad? Yes. I beg you, see for yourselves. Once you have done so well, you will understand. All right then. Now then, may I ask what the two of you intend to do next? Well, whatever's going on out there, the only thing we can do right now is just keep rounding up more mirages, am I right? Oh? Apparently, at one time we commanded a whole legion of them. But somehow, we lost them along with our memories. So, we're hoping by getting the mirages back, we might stumble on some clues about our past. That's right. So if mirages like those goblins are bugging you, we can lay down the smack. Lay down... the what? Uh, I think what he's trying to say is we'll help you out, or at least in the best way we know how. Oh, wonderful. You have my thanks. Mine and all Cornelia's. Still, if we're going to be any help, don't you think we need to beef up our arsenal first? Cause we can't put up much of a fight without some strong mirages. Good point. Princess, 
Do you know of any nearby places where strong mirages live? Certainly. If you travel to the northeast of Cornelia, you'll find the Nether Nebula, a network of caverns inhabited by many wild mirages. Ooh, nice. Well, Not at all. Savage mirages have been sighted in the nebula. You may well end up dead. Th that's cool. If you insist upon going, then please take the utmost caution. He will, your highness. Otherwise, he's gonna be extremely sorry! Wait a minute, why just me? What did I do? I think we all know what you did. Um, real quick question. Is the sound in sync? Like, there should be beeps when I move this hand. Is it just off sync? It should ha happen exactly when it moves. Because I, I, I'm just wondering if the sound's off sync, because sometimes it does get off sync. Um... It's been out of sync. Why didn't anybody tell me? Hold on, I can fix that. I can fix that, give me a second. How about now? Okay. I didn't fucking anybody tell me. Just, guys. When something like that happens, let me know. I can fix it. <laughs> Bothering you. It bothers me. I am somewhat of a perfectionist. It looks like we'll need to wind our way down to reach the exit. Seems that way. What a funny way to build a town. Oh, it's not that the strange to the people of Grimoire. Hey, while we're here, why don't we ask around town and to see what we can find out? Behold, I am your superior, for I am twice as tall as you. Wait, <laughs> yeah. Uh, what am I gonna do? Oh, say. You wouldn't happen to be the giants from the hills by any chance, would you? You see, there's a situation I'm dealing with where I could really use your assistance, since you must know Mirage so well. Could I trouble you to please bring me an earth hammer? If you could, I would be forever in your debt. Earth hammer. It's like being over six feet every day. I would not know. Huh? What's this thing? Oh! I was hoping the path might link the up here. Hey, Tama! Wait up! in Ninewood Hills? You see, the gate here doesn't connect to just one the area. All throughout Grimoire, you'll find places. Save the locations that lead back here. Open the way to come and to go as you please. And how exactly do we do that? You already have the song. Just walk up to the right place and that's all it takes. But surely a means of transportation that handy must come with a catch? No, the catch! You can use the gate as the little or much as you like. What's more, time in here and time in Grimoire, they don't both the flow at the same speed. So whatever crisis is going to down, you can put it on hold and kick back here till you're ready. Whoa, it's like magic. Yeah, really irresponsible magic. <laughs> Just imagine <laughs> revisiting any place we've been. We'll call it the Super Porta Park. Are you the kidding? That name definitely gets an F. He deserves an H. An H? But grades only go down to F! I mean... Extra, extra, read all about it. What, what 
Maybe you're the one here, Serapy. In case you're wondering, you can use the prism case anywhere you find one of these gates. Oh, I think I would get it now. Gates are the what you meant when you talked about a strong connection. Huh? Oh, right, right. That's the gist of it. So, this game's nice about let, keeping you up to speed about where you're supposed to be. Um, I wonder if we can buy a hammer okay, here. to the Nether Nebula. Yeah, let's... Let's go to Nine Hill Woods, see if we can't buy, um... Buy stuff from Chocolate. I don't like that name. God. Mm. That name. So one of your mirages has learned the stroll ability, it will follow you around in the field, just as the lump. Hey, Chocolate, do you have a hammer? Step right! Welcome to... Well then, Thank never you. mind! I guess I'll have to go find one the hard way, you jerk. That face. Oh, I hate walking everywhere. I can read you like a book. Huh? Me? Yeah. I know a lazy slacker when I see one. Hey. What's up? Oh, just some news you may find of interest. Ha, ha, ha. It'll blow your little minds. Why? Because you will never believe this. Yeah? Huh? All throughout Ninewood Hills, I have staked out some windways. Windways? Steak! Now that you mention it, I'm starving. Have you got anything else tasty on the menu? Oh, sure. Here you are. Might I recommend today's special, the Sahagin Soup? Stop that! We'll never get to the point if you egg them on like that! Huh? You want eggs? Oh, fried? Sunny side up? Hmm. All we've got is scrambled. Just tell us about the windways! Oh, those? They're basically just shortcuts. The kids call it fast travel. You get to zip around every which way using one of those gooey doohickeys. Yep. Uh, I don't think you're allowed to go there. So what if the food's a little gooey? I'll still eat it. We are not talking about food! Oh. Wait, I get it. All that business about steak, that was a pun. Nice one, Lon. Oh, thank you. Don't tell me you thought he was serious! <laughs> <laughs> I realized something just the now. We can never leave Lon and Seraphie alone together. Nothing good could come of it. Cool. Let's go find a hammer for that guy, I guess. Oh, there's a little Chocobo family back there. Oh, look at that. Oh, they're so cute together. Oh, they got a little baby and everything. I had to steal mine. They just made theirs by themselves. If you get poisoned in battle, the toxins... Here. Antidote. 
Oh, okay, if I talk to people, then they'll just give me stuff. So maybe one of these people has a hammer? <laughs> Chocobo feathers! You scared! You see, the Bahamush... You know what I can't wrap my Many people who stand opposed to the feather You have to marvel at the princess's stubbornness. Of course, you won't <laughs> I knew it! So giants if I became a giant If we cooperated Why do you have with fish on your head countries, Come to think of it, our neighbor. I wonder if there aren't any power. I'm sorry, but you have fish on your head. So the giants from the hills weren't just a. Uh, who cares? A Thank you again for. Okay, no clue on where I can find one. All right, thanks. Cult fan issue one. What? about Oh, Oglops. Yeah, I remember Oglops are from Final Fantasy 9. There's a Final Fantasy 9 reference here in this Final Fantasy 1 town. Hell yeah. Love it. I live and breathe. Just between. Behind. Hey, Queen, do you have. Princess, do you happen Queen. to have a. Version of the song. Love it. Ah, oh, that's so great. Alright, so we can't find the hammer in town, so we're just gonna have to remember to bring this guy a hammer. Why do you have a fish? Why do so many people have fishes on their heads? Chapter 3 Old Acquaintances She said the Nether Nebula is somewhere northeast of Cornelia, right? Time to go hustle and rustle a little mirage muscle. Just don't hustle so much that you get yourself lost, okay? I might just leave you there. <laughs> When's the last time I got... Don't push it. Okay. Hey look, it's a treasure chest. Maybe this has our hammer in it. Or it just has a bunch of potions. I mean, I'm not going to say no to a bunch of potions. Honestly. Wow, the air here is so clean. Yeah, right? Yahoo! You're a Yahoo. Wait, no, no, Rain. You need to shout for it to work. Yahoo! Here are a lot the stronger than any you faced the before. 
Yeah, let's not mess around in the never neba thing nabob Nether? Nebula! Do you think you can do something about that habit of forgetting the name of virtually everything? Oh, here's another gate. That's the right! Gates that usually turn up in towns or at the start of most mirage-infested areas. You never have to travel far to the visit a place you've been. Whenever you want to get from point the A to point the B, just use the gate as a handy little shortcut. A shortcut, huh? So, like, if we wanted to go back to Cornelia right this instant, we could just take this gate back to Ninewood Hills, then we can take the gate from there to Cornelia. You see? All in all, it makes for a pretty short shortcut. Yeah! If it were hair, you'd have to call it... You'd have to call it a buzz cut! Okay. I mean, he's not wrong. Ibram Mirajul. Come on, sis. Let's make this good. Dude, it's all. Oh, hey, it's Mandaraga, I guess. There we go. Oh yeah. Uh, so what should we name it? Man, the rockets live all over the world. These little guys may look cute, but don't touch. They're poisonous. While no one's ever sighted one in the process of growing, you can never be too safe. So if you see two floppy leaves sticking up, be smart and don't yank them. But should we name the Mandaraga? Wait, is a stat? Okay then. I guess it makes sense for, like, stacking purposes. How easy it is to get toppled. Suggesting any names for my plant baby. Guess what? Spaces it'll fit.
guessing that's the only name everybody has anybody has for it, so Tandagora it is. Yeah, fine. Just behave yourself. Also, my stream health is really bad, so I'm gonna stop the stream and restart it real quick. I guess we're doing oh, this. Oh, hey! Look at these little dudes. Little rock dudes. Mini golem. So, you know what? Let's knock this guy out. That way, they don't get two attacks on us. These hit guys hit like a Mack truck, apparently. Spolems. Hmm. Molnum sounds like a good name for one. I gotta ever catch the damn thing. Oh my god, really? Oh my god, really? <laughs> Come on! These aren't like Pokeballs, so they don't break when you fail. Come on! Really? You can run out? Or does it just because I. Oh, right! It's just because I failed imprisoning it too many times. Dungeon is way more dungeony than I thought. Did you know that originally dungeon referred to the biggest tower in a castle? It's what they called the castle keep. How long has it been since I've heard Rain go off on one of her educational rants? She must be pretty upset. Then why is that? The more upset she gets, the more she tries to cover it up by spouting random trivia. You know where <laughs> the word trivia comes from? Sis, I think we're good. <laughs> Ooh, a sleek stone. Hey, my chocobo found something. A protect stone. Jeez. Okay.
Okay, time for some items. I need to feel myself bad. There. Say it's worth it. It's a good, it's a good game. Um, let's try. Let's deal with the floating eye. Why can't I use this in the end? Ah, the only mirage standing. Okay. What I wanted all the time. Oh, I got it first try. Unstack before uh, it decides to unstack. here guys so there's different pokeballs for every species yes uh, composed in almost entirely of copper this metal with the me metal takes pride with this in his tough hide it is incredibly satisfying to face one of these and shout yeah she I'll never take me alive copper you get that reference and congratulations you are old so what should we name this guy what should we name this little copper gnome Uh, I don't like really influencing the v vote, but here's my suggestion. I'm this is what I'm considering naming him, but you guys are free to interject with your own suggestions, as usual. Nobody's coming up with a suggestion, so I'm just gonna go and go ahead and name this Capone in the next 20 seconds if nobody says anything. Alright, we're moving on. 
thing's name is Capone. A mirage that looks like someone stapled a set of arms and legs to a head. Likes charging his enemies while singing, Go, go, call him body slam. But seriously, who doesn't? Uh. Oh, wow, this is his only form. Hmm. Anyway, what should you name this little guy? Uh, how about somebody. Somebody. To, oh, that's right. It's Molem. Somebody gave this suggestion earlier. Back when I was trying to capture one. And it just would not. It just wouldn't. It just wouldn't. But, uh, we, we, we can name something else. I'll give you all 30 seconds to come up with a better name. Because we seriously still have one more of these things to name. And I'm not sitting around here waiting for it. Molem it is. A winged eyeball that slings magic. Pro tip for keeping yourself awake at night. Try to visualize his heart and brain slurping around. Sorry, glish lurping killed me. <laughs> uh, what should we name this thing? How about this? If anybody has a better name, then um, speak in the next uh, 40 seconds or forever hold your peace. seconds. All right, so we got a bunch of these new things now. Uh, I think we should move away from our from our original party. Um, especially since now we have at least one medium uh, thing to to stack to put in this stack when we're big so let's go let's give her a slurp let's swap out big bird for um pixie cat because i think pixie cat has some healing capabilities and now um let's give him capone and Yeah, let's just make him a phys like a physical brick powerhouse. That seems good. That seems like a good idea. Just give him all of the strength in the world. Um, let's see. I don't think we have any new large things. Yeah. Does every mirage have to stand on the protagonist's head? Um, when when they are in this form, yes. Uh, so. The way uh, 
this game works is that you have to stack things and you have to stack a small on top of a medium on top of a large. So when your characters are like this, they are large. And when your characters are like this, they are medium. There's no, there's no point where they are small. Um, so yeah, all, all the stuff is just stacked on top of people and it's ridiculous. <laughs> Psycho characters, there we are. Uh, let's see, Mandaraga. Stroll. Accuracy raises his accuracy. Leaf. Sleep leads, ooh. Going. Go this way, let's get sleep leads. Take less physical damage, increases accuracy. Double smash. Ooh, let's save up for double smash. Recycled around. Yes. Okay. Hi, what do you want? Gimme, gimme. Okay, which is good considering we used two of them in the last fight. Whew. Are you kidding me? Mirages can stack too? Yep, you're not the only ones who get way the stronger when you're piled up. Do their abilities change when they're stacked to them? Afraid the so. Which means somebody needs to stop underestimating the enemy before he defines himself up to his neck in some. Okay. At least he knows the warning's meant for him. Ah, oh, jeez. I thought that was a good one. Oh, yeah. yeah, we're not... Yeah. Enemies can stack. It's... It's a good, it's a good game that follows its own consistent rules. If you can stack, of course your enemies can stack. Why wouldn't they? That makes that makes sense. It does it make sense? Wow. 
What's this for? It's a strange switch that oh the response to the mirages. Oh my God, land and rain. Are they like the mirages into you each imprison other? the inside these caves should be able to help you out. Okay, so wait, five or greater earth resistance, fifty or greater. Okay, because it needs to be medium. There's a spot for medium as well. Conditions bet. Convenient. And there's another switch path. all the way out there. Check out that switchcraft. Yep. Now we know switch way to the go. Switchever one of you thinks you're being clever is about to get a knuckle sand switch. Ugh. Did did I just get owned? I'm the raising the white flag here too. Hey, right. what do you want? What do you what is your deal? It's five or greater earth resistance, 75 or oh, We just did that. Hell yeah. Treasure chests. Oh, hey! Oh, it even tells you when you meet the conditions. Oh, that's nice! Ah, oh, jeez. Okay. Uh, ooh, top of strength high. Yeah. Ah! Or we can miss. That also works. Uh oh. Uh, let's unstack before we topple over and completely lose that turn. All right, so. Hey, Tama, weird question. Um, how come all this really useful, well presented information keeps popping into our heads? Oh, that? I guess in a crow is the trying to give you some tips. Dude, really? And here I thought I was some kind of super genius coming up with all the answers on my own. 
I hate to the break. Hey, heavy metal you, loser. You will never be that person. I know. Oh no. What so is such Oh no! no. Hey, now, come on. You don't have to look that broken hearted when you say oh, it. Oh I think Lon just died. I think Lon just got owned so hard that he died. Spill the drink on the uh, keyboard. Now my number one doesn't work. Oh no! Oh, that's not the good. This is the called a threshold. Mirages that create them to mark their territory. When you see a threshold, you better watch out, cause the mirages inside are extremely the powerful. And the worst part, if you cross it and lose a fight, the inside, I can't use my powers to rewind time and extricate you. No extrication? Guess we'd better be extra careful then. <laughs> Anyway, it sounds like if we're going in, we better go in fully prepared. That's the for sure! And don't to forget to save your progress, too! Alright. Customize your shortcuts. Neat. Okay. Well, let's save before, um... Before we do this. Because I, I remember, I think, what the boss is here. What the honk?! Be careful! Oh, I expected some foolhardy adventurer with a terminal case of curiosity. What's this? Well, look who's back. Ah, the half pints. Pale and well met. Hail and Wellmet? That's not our names! I think he just means hello. Oh, and for the record, he happens to be a half-wit and a half-pint. <laughs> <laughs> you haven't changed a bit. Huh? What's so funny? Oh, you're having a lawn moment. Guess I'll just add this one to the pile. Wait, what pile? There's a pile? Apparently, we've met the three of you before, although we don't remember it. You do not remember us? Really? No wonder they haven't summoned us. Then our course of action is clear. We must ensure the pecking order is pecking in the right order. If you seek to command the three of us again, then demonstrate your strength <coughs> now or else be destroyed! Die! Hold now! Why must you two always let the blood rush to your head? W uh, what do you mean? Would you just look at them? These are not the Mirage Keepers we knew. Ooh. Hi. You're right. They do look rather... How do I put it? Put what? Mon does set the bar low. Like Limbo the bar low. Hmm? Ah... Uh. I see. See what? Very well. What say we pit them against just one of us to keep things nice and fair? Hmm. Agreed then. Go on. Choose from among us and choose wisely. Choose for what? Time certainly has not made you any more clever. What we're trying to say is the two of you are no match for all three of us at once. Which means... Right, I get it. Thanks. Now, let's see. Huh? Wait, get what? Yeah, I'm gonna... Of course I'm gonna choose Ifrit. Ifrit's the coolest one! Choose 
It's me! I know Big you devil. missed it. Big Step devil dog, now hell yeah! The searing embrace of my hellfire! No, if it's a hot dude, the cool dude Careful. is uh is he's a looks Shiva. like he's all muscle. Alright! Let's turn up the heat! Uh, I think he's got that part covered. Oh geez, that did barely anything to him. Uh, uh, uh. Okay, good. Now I can do this. That wasn't too bad. Okay. We beat him! We did it! Wasn't too bad! Oh, we got a Mega Phoenix! Enough! I have seen my fill for one day! That was fun, for what it was. A shame the two of you have so much growing up to do. Quiet, you! I'm a Hulk waiting to happen. So long, we shall meet again. Well, our paths may cross before you know it. Bye-bye for now. But I don't even get the summon? Ah. Oh. Huh? What's this? A prismarium, duh. I know it's a prismarium, dummy. You didn't manage to imprison those tough mirages, but it looks the like they give you this prismarium from the same tribe as a consolation prize. I see. I guess we made the grade then. Team Frick! <laughs> Wait, 
claims his horn get frequent compliments, wears a warm scarf despite basically being on fire. <laughs> Uh, uh, I see, I see a name. Chip Frit. Mm, I like Fred. Oh, actually. Ooh, Fritz. Yes, Fritz is better. I like Fritz better. Uh, does anybody else have any names that I like better than, than Fritz? Going once. Going twice. Gold. The mirages of the nebula have been set free. And once again, time resumes its march. Well, we better make our way back to Cornelia before the Baja Mushins get any funny ideas. We gotta go all the way back. You can head to Ninewood Hills right then now if you want to. Huh? Now that the boss has been the bested, I can make you an exit gate right the here and now. Ta -da -da! It'll take you the back to Ninewood Hills, and from there, Cornelia's easy. Thanks to the buzz cut, I remember. <gasps> you don't get shortcuts much the shorter than a buzz cut. Wait! Unless you buzz the buzz cut, and then the what have you got? Uh, I think, I just think at that point... Up. You call it Brain, a cut. Stop stealing my jokes! Get out of my headspace, woman! My god! Okay. Uh, so. What's. What size is our news friend? Is he small or is he medium? Ah, he's small. Okay. Let's see what his mirage board is like. This will burn objects or life fuses and let's him walk. Yeah, let's learn sizzle and let's learn stroll. Punch. Fire. Okay, so we can learn fire, we can learn punch, and we can learn magic plus. Which I don't think magic plus. Uh would actually come in handy considering he doesn't really know all that much magic right now, so we'll just I think we'll work towards learning fire. Cover HP. While we're there, we should stop by Chocolates and stock up on items. Hey, you got it. Mm -hmm. 
Need something? We don't really have enough money to make chocolates uh, worthwhile, does it? So let's go back to town. Chapter 4 A Legendary Warrior. I think this was the last okay, chapter then. I stopped. Let's playing check on. in with Princess Sarah. It's the Bahamutian Army! What? They're here already? I haven't even turned in my side quest. Oh no, there's somebody animal! They're setting up camp! Right outside of town! And they're fast! Rain! Long! <laughs> Perfect timing! We were actually just on our way to see you! If they've established a camp near our gates, then clearly they must intend to finish us once and for all. So what now? Seems to me, we're going to have to nip this little problem in the butt. Hmm? What do you propose we do? We should take the fight to them. Uh, well said, but as things stand, Cornelia simply does not have the manpower. If you can just buy us some time, we'll do the rest. Huh? Why is Me the and Rain will so sneak tiny? up on their boss and it's take a, it's him a out. Thing. It's a thing. It's a thing in this uh, game. It, is it really that simple? Well, he may not exactly look it, but Lon's pretty good in a fight. Thing is, he used to get picked on for being such a pipsqueak. Please, as if you were ever any taller than me. Oh, well, I might have made up the pipsqueak part, but he definitely did get picked on. I think that maybe. The other kids were a little creeped out by our arms. <sighs> Still, we were always kind of proud that we look like this. Because it meant we were just like our mom, right? I guess. So, let's talk more about Long getting picked on. Boy, did they make him cry. But, after I whipped him into shape, he never lost a fight again. <sighs> Wonderful. But that's not because... He turned into some kind of bully-destroying machine. He just literally never picked a fight he couldn't win. Really? His threat assessment skills were uncanny. He always knew the odds. <laughs> Call it natural cowardice. Hey, watch it. So long. How about it? Do you think we can beat those guys? Piece of cake? Well, not a piece of cake. More like a very large sliver of cake. Well, there you have it. So, are you willing to trust us? Very well, then. We must act. It is only a matter of time before the Federation completely overruns Cornelia. We will fight and place our faith in the Mirage Keepers. Huh. What a weird thing to remember. I know someone bullied Lon, but why can't I remember who? Oh no! Anyway, uh, so this is why this so they're so tiny because that's part of the game's mechanics that you can swap between being tiny and being large. Where's the guy who wants me to? Did I lose out on that side quest forever because I didn't turn it in right away? Hello there. Are you the Keepers from the Prophecy? I'm Captain of the Cornelian Army 1st Brigade. Princess Sarah has appointed us as Vanguard. 
We have been informed of the particulars. We'll time our feint to when the two of you storm the field. You can set out just as soon as you're ready. The only thing I can think of is where fuck go pop down and that annoys me. the goblin camp up on that hill come on where's the goblin camp he says it's like really did you not notice the towers right there oh, they look so adorable fighting Let's hurry up and circle around and knock the goblin's boss senseless. Okay. The wish and boosh. Oh yeah. According to the Vanguard's reports, many of the enemy forces are capable of inflicting blindness. It impairs your eyesight and causes your weapon attacks to miss more frequently. Although thankfully, magical attacks remain unaffected. Oh, why don't you take these eye drops? They'll clear up your vision in no time flat. Is it realistic just a cosmetic thing, or is it part of the game world? Um, Good luck out there. It is part We're of the game world. You. They actually acknowledge the fact that you can switch between back and forth. It's also a mechanical thing, because uh, the way the game works is that you can only stack uh, large at the bottom, medium on the middle, and small on the top. And like this, you are considered large, but like this, you are considered medium. So you have different stacks and uh, different monsters that, uh, that you can stack on top of each other and stuff. Living Towers of the Noise! <laughs> what are those chain things? Whoever the mirages are beholden to must be close. What? B.O.? Stop it. Yeah, the game was back ahead of stack. Is there a benefit of using the small form? Um, we don't have any right now, but there are monsters that are large size, and you can only use monsters that are large size when you are small. And also, you can ride them for uh, certain benefits as well when you are small. Um, Good luck. But we ha we don't have any access to large type uh, monsters quite yet. So, unfor so, unfortunately, there's no benefit to being small at the moment. Eventually, there will definitely be a, a benefit to being, being small. Yeah, you have to pick between being a big monster and a medium monster. Um, there's no, there's no small form, as far as I know. Um, I don't think there is. At all. And if there is, I've never heard anything about it. Girl's Diary, huh? Entry 1! This thing seems awfully familiar. Uh, let's read the girl's diary.
Oh no, we have to save this poor man. Man, dang, I thought I could get rid of two monsters in one turn. Diary. I just got a diary. Yep. Uh, let's see here. Fritz learned. Has Fritz gotten any more SP? No. How did he get SP? Or do I just. Okay, I don't think I've gotten enough SP. Okay, we have to be level 10 or higher to get that one. Uh, oh, five. Jeez. Okay. Yeah, let's look here. That might help come in handy. Six. He has to be level 10. Let's learn double smash so that way we can just immediately move right into it. What else? Uh, oh, we have two. Okay, so I can't really learn anything. Strength plus, P plus, and use seeds in this base to learn custom abilities. Mm. Let's go with strength plus. Ooh, plus maybe. Defense plus. Shake. Let's go with shake actually. Couple some stacks. This will get us to sleep leaves, which is something I definitely want. This is the only thing we can learn. And this is the only thing we can learn, but we can't get there yet. So, slightly raises the points. Ooh, here. That transformation doesn't have any... Ah, we're so close. Eight! Holy crap! Okay, we've been neglecting this guy. Hypnosis, yeah! Uh, ooh. Yes, let's do that. Ultimate focus, gain magic up. Hit points and slightly more magic. I think I just went through this guy. Yeah, let's get that. I want to. I want to try and transform him ASAP. So. I should have known that wasn't the last of them. Thank you. I owe you my life. I know this isn't much, but here, I want you to have this. Let's play as let's play as uh, Rain for a little bit. I'm tired of controlling the idiot. It seems like Rain would be more the kind to take charge anyway. Let's go. Come on, bring it. Nice knowing ya. You're done. That 
was a good time. Oh, yeah! Position further up the plains. Be very careful. I'm not intending to grind very much for this game. Uh, it doesn't seem like it requires all that much grinding. Um, seems pretty easy. All injured soldiers have been ordered to fall back to this point and wait for further orders. Please finish this fight for us. Take a look at the map. Um, seems that. Yeah, it seems that the progress is up that way. Let's go behind this way and see what we can find. Unga! Unga! How humiliating! Oh no! Unga foiled again! your valiant efforts to go unrewarded. There! Keep up the good work, you two! You don't have to yell them right here. Come in handy. Um, yeah, you know what? We need to swap some of Lan's stuff because the way he's set up, like, he cannot heal himself at all. So, um, bye bye, small. Hello, big bird. Dude, it's on. Oh, oh, no thing, no thing. Yeah, you get, you get essentially Pokeballs, um, they're called Prisms, uh, every time you run into a new enemy type, which is nice, you just get what you need to catch them right there. I think you can also buy more later. Yeah, we got a new dog! We got a dog, guys! Yeah! Good job! A 
neck with a high resistance to fire. Even his teeth are like hot coals. You could probably grill a hamburger in there if you could just keep it get keep its mouth open. <laughs> Yeah, basically you only have to uh, buy it. buy one if you want a duplicate. Um, what should we name our little fire dog? What should we name our little fire puppy, guys? No, no, no. Let me change it. I mean, <laughs> it makes sense. It's, it's, uh, quite frankly, a little too obvious, but that's my suggestion. If anybody else has, if anybody else has a, uh, has, has any other suggestions as to what to name our new puppy friend. And he, believe you and me, this guy's going right in the party. <laughs> There's no way I'm not using this cool dog. guys another 15 seconds Mr. Burns ooh 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 that's good Frankfurt hmm really like Mr. Burns and I really like Frankfurt Mr. Burns is more punny. So if anybody, unless anybody else has a funnier name than Mr. Burns. I'll give you guys another uh, 20 seconds. seconds. Done, Mr. Burns. <laughs> yeah, this guy's going right in our party. Uh, who's he gonna... Oh, he's a small, so he's gonna have to replace Big Bird. That's just, that's just how it's gonna have to work. He's just gonna have to replace Big Bird. I'm sorry, Lon. You're not getting any way to heal yourself. He has three SP. Let's see what we can do on his Mirage board. This is something huge! Where is that? Like, wh where's this transformer? Okay, transformation. It doesn't have any minimum level requirements. We can just work our way right there. Uh, we should actually also get that because that looks pretty important. So, even though it's not working towards the transformation, uh, probably better we go that way. Captain, I'm just not cut out for battle. Oh man, he must be super close if he's showing up in the um Oh! Oh no! Thank <laughs> you. 
good! It broke the chains! Yes! Alright. Um... Oh, but we don't have any... We don't have any way to stop. Any way to capture Dang. Get it! Oh, no! No, the opponent has learned the power of stacking. There's... There are wait enemies that stack in the game. We've already run into them. It's a mechanic. Are you okay? We got this! Fine, we'll just kill the goblin guard. Whatever. I don't give a fuck. So he's probably got some, some of my soldiers spend. swore they'd seen the princess on the battlefield. I suppose I got a bit careless. Uh, princess Sarah was here? What? No way. That can't be right. I'd like to think so. But knowing her, it's possible. Still, you must focus on the task at hand. Don't worry about me. You two should press on. Up ahead, you will find the Bahamutian soldier in charge. He leads the goblins. Cool. Let's do this. All right. If we're about to run into the boss, we should probably heal. Yes. Yeah, I could have sworn I saw Princess Sarah on the front lines. Okay, joining the battle is fine and dandy, but maybe not in the front lines when you have an entire country to run, Princess Sarah. Come on. Stacked. See how you like this. Here goes. Ah! I'm so glad they put like a basic ass fast forward function into combat. It is super appreciated that you can just fast forward through the parts that like where nothing is happening. Oh my god, that is such a good design decision. Predictable. When you have 
semi turn based combat like that. That is such a good, good idea to do. Uh, let's check out the Mirage Wards. Let's see. We've got three. I obtained a Furt Prison. Okay, so I need to reach level 15 before I can transform him. Um, Link's base acquired. Yeah, let's use a seed on that. Uh, let's, use the, let's use the Cure Seed, actually. How do I do that? How do I use the Cure Seed? Um... Place a custom ability, yes. Cure seed. Cool. The enemies go at a different speed than you. Yeah, um, it's it's all based on like your speed stat and stuff. So minus one. Yes, three. Yes, one. Three. Yeah, Mr. Burns has five. Let's take a look. I don't even know what Mr. Burns turns into, but I'm really looking forward to figuring out what. I'm imagining Furt becomes Ifrit. Oh no! That soldier's in trouble! It's just a har harder to follow ATV. Not really! I would say it's an easier to follow ATB. Like, I can tell exactly when the enemies are gonna move. Yeah, it's, that's the perfect way to describe it. It's ATV without dead air. He turns like, yeah, there is technically dead air, but I can fast forward through the dead air, which is, again, super appreciated. That was a good fight. Also, also, um, the thing is, uh, the way I have it set up, it is kind of turn-based because I have it set to wait. Uh, you can set it to active or semi-active. I don't know what the hell semi-active would even entail. But I have it set to wait because I don't have anything to prove by having it be on active. I don't care for active. I like being able to sit down and think things through. Yeah, but you said it was harder to follow, and I don't. I don't think it's harder to follow. I think it's quite easier to follow. They and they do call Thanks it ATV. The help just now. They you do call it uh, the, the active commander. time battles. Is that right? Take this. So um, it'll come in handy. It's, it's not like they're trying to hide the fact that it's active time battle. We won't let Cornelia fall. Yes, yeah, it's, it's a huge QOL uh, He's gonna summon a cool dog that I can Yeah, again, he summoned a cool dog that I can't capture because I don't have any appropriate crystals. What the hell, game?
played Octopath. We did it! That wasn't so bad. Why are they not putting dogs on their heads? Listen, sometimes dogs aren't good boys. And sometimes dogs misbehave, so they won't be able to put their dogs on their heads. However, I only recruit the best boys, so therefore they go straight on my noggin. Princess? Dude, she is here! <laughs> I guess she's the hands-on type. <gasps> Your Highness! Behind you! Huh? Look out! <laughs> Are you alright, Highness? Uh, yes. Thank you. Oh, schmuck! We gotta find a way down there now! But we can go around! If we're fast enough, we... No! There's no time! <laughs> It's that guy. No, it's the guy from one. This is the light warrior. Princess Sarah, you okay? Dude, that move was awesome. I don't know what just happened. I think I do. That light would explain it. Good captain. From this day on, you shall be called the warrior of light. Me? Are you sure? Yes. The legends of Cornelia tell of others like you. Nameless heroes with great power in their hearts. Warriors of light. You're a medium. Don't question it. One with the potential to become this realm's champion. Wait, a medium? A champion? Champions arise at critical points in time where they awaken unexpectedly to their miraculous power. Candidates who hide this light within them, the strength, we call them mediums. The warriors of light, of course, are unique to Cornelian legend, but mediums for other champions can still be found throughout Grimoire to this day. Incredible. So I'm really one of them? Yes. There is no mistake. I think the light Lon and Rain sent me was a sort of revelry. Like I'd been sleeping my whole life and finally woke up. Do you have that power? Do you have the this... ability to awaken mediums as um, champions? It was technically oh. spelled with I an wish R, we knew. but like uh, I said, that's because we don't remember all that much about who we are. Out. Wait, hold on. Please stand back, Princess Sarah. This guy must be their boss. Lon, what it looks like the soldier's demon. Don't get carried away. Rain, I'm shocked. I don't pick on people weaker than me. <laughs> I just had to make sure. Let's go, Lon. Yeah! This thing is the massive! Seriously? Come on! What do they feed him anyway? Ah, uh, maybe we could stew over that some other time. Oh, what do you think? Let's see here. Um... <laughs> Super cops back! Oh no! Critical 
chance my rear. It even missed what? There we go. On. Seriously? Big enemy is smiling, yeah. Um... Cake. Wait, this soldier's not human at all. Was he a mirage? What? No. The soldiers are human beings planning to become architects and join the Federation elite. What happened to him?
How many years have passed? Time for us has resumed its march. Seguarelis! Yes, what is it? You may begin. I trust you have worked out each detail? Oh, I can assure you every word. Then away with you. We have a prophecy to fulfill. Let us usher in a new age of history. They seem like nice people. Yeah, yeah, they spell giant weird. It's just <laughs> fucking. Now would be a good time to stock up on items. Good call. We've racked up a ton of gil now that you mention it. You have to wonder why a bunch of mirages are carrying so much cash. Let's just say that in a crow. Never mind. I figured it was her. <laughs> Yeah, God just like decided to put cash on the monsters. Whatever, who cares? So, why don't we go back to Cornelia and see Princess Sarah? Oh, hey, they have a uh, Kate Sith plushie in here. I didn't notice that. I noticed the um the Chocobo and the Cactar ones, but I did not notice Kate Sith. Uh, let's see what else they have. They have a Moogle. They have a Okami Game Sphere. Um. Oh no, it's the coolest Moogle. It's, it's got shades and everything. Huh? Look at the stone! It's so pretty! Oh! Those are the called Mirajules! They're specialty items made by isolating a Mirage's abilities. If either the one of you equips them, you'll be able to wield whatever the abilities they hold. The right Mirajules with the right the stack can make for a powerful combination. Hmm. Let's see. I wonder if I can turn in that side quest now. Chapter 5 The Champion Who Saved Grimoire what? What? Ah yeah, it looks like everything's back to normal now. Why do people have fishes on their head? This is so weird. Cornelia alone for a while, now that we've gotten rid of the soldier controlling them. Once mirages are scattered and separated from their keeper, 
they revert to their wild state. And wild mirages are something you just learn to get used to in Grimoire. That's why you've got Mr. Warrior here. Yes, indeed. However, we cannot rule out the possibility of another Bahamut attack. What we need is an alliance with another country. Some sort of mutual agreement to come to each other's defense. Actually, word has been spreading of such an organization. An anti-federation group as large as a nation. Perhaps the time has come to formally introduce ourselves. They call themselves the League of S. League of S? Do you know of any way to reach them? The Thane of Saronia to the north has been in contact with them. I believe one of the merchants mentioned it. Saronia, yes. They have been resisting Federation annexation. Yes. Highness, allow me to journey there and learn what I can about the League of S. Alone? To get to Saronia, you must pass through all manner of places teeming with dangerous mirages. And I... Hey, maybe we could go instead. Yeah! Mr. Warrior here, he and the Brigade should stick around and keep the goblins in line. That's right. Cornelia's legendary champion belongs right here in Cornelia. We're the best fit for this. We've got tons of mirages to collect, and could start just about anywhere. So, you know, it wouldn't be any trouble. What a kind offer. You would really do that? Sure. You're doing us a favor by pointing me and Lon in a new direction. We're glad to help. I thank you. We are in your debt. Here, all Cornelian emissaries are given these letters. Actually, I was just about to stop because this seems like a good stopping point. Um, it should done help a bunch. you. On your this way. is actually about Thanks. where I stopped playing the first time. Well, I played there's this no game, sense so. in hanging around. Hmm. So long. Take care. Bye bye. Goodbye. Uh, your I played highness. a little further than this, but I don't remember anything that happens. I was just gonna uh, print in the side quest and then save and then be done with it. So you're not gonna miss out too much. Okay, then let's get going to the Saronia place. Just hop on the train and take that choo-choo to the north! Oh! You really brought me an earth hammer! I can't tell you how much I appreciate this. Now I can ensure my helmet is always in tip-top condition. I can't stand unsightly dents. I know it isn't much, but please accept this as a token of my thanks. Five high tokens. Yeah, let's go to the save, uh, save person down here, and then stop playing for now. All right, thanks for watching, everybody. Uh, I have fun. Thanks for all the good names. You got a good dog. Good dog. Different chance an earth hammer from any other hammer. Um, one's made out of dirt. I'll leave you to decide which one. Anyway, uh, thanks for watching, everybody. I'll, I'll see you all later. Bye.